Welcome to a quick tutorial on how to set up OpenAI's Codex command line interface in your project. The quick start guide is available on the GitHub repo. I'll also leave the link in the description below. You will also need an OpenAI API key and a credit balance to use this CLI. First, we're going to install it globally, so we can simply copy the command and paste it into our terminal. Once installed, we can open up our project folder. I already have a project open here in VS Code. Next, we can add our OpenAI API key to our environment file in our project. So you can just create a .env file and then add your API key there. Make sure your env file is in the root of your project. Now that my API key has been added, I can open up the terminal in my folder and start using the OpenAI Codex CLI. To use, simply type Codex and your prompt. You can also specify a specific OpenAI model if you choose. I'm just going to go with the default for now. Cool, now we can see that it is working. To follow up with another prompt, we can simply type the new message in the send message box. Now let's try having it edit our file. Let's ask it to create a login page UI. Okay, awesome. It proposed the changes for the login page. Let's accept. Now we can confirm that it has been updated. It automatically also saves the updated file. Now let's run a development server and live preview the login page UI OpenAI Codex CLI just developed. It looks nice and clean and just what I need. Finally, let's see how much these two prompts cost me in terms of API credits. I initially had 10 USD in API credits. Now I have $9.77, so these two prompts cost me 23 cents. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.